Ladies and gentlemen, this category, the winner for this online category goes to Olufi Sayo Shoyombo. He's walking like a winner, isn't it? <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you very much. You can stand there. Now, Olufi Sayo, for his, this is for his story undercover in Boronu. Boronu children are dying at IDP camps. Foodstuff are disappearing. You all know that very touching story. At Sema store. It was published in the cable newspaper on the 29th of December 2017. Now, upon hearing that the government and emergency officials were diverting relief aid meant for victims of insurgency in the Northeast, Fisayo embarked on an undercover investigation. And he disguised as a relief aid donor in order to penetrate an IDP camp and the Borono State Emergency Management Agency. His investigations revealed that government agents had been stealing food and other aid materials meant for victims of Boko Haram insurgency housed in Borono IDP camps. And after the story was published, President Muhammad Buhari said his government was aware of some of the mistakes and wrongdoings in handling the affairs of the IDPs. And in April 2017, suspended Babachir Lawal, secretary to the government of the Federation, following his indictment by the Senate for allegedly mismanaging funds in his capacity as chairman of the presidential initiative on the Northeast in Nigeria. Fisayo was winner of the online category of the 2016 Wale Shoinka Award for Investigative Reporting, <laughs> as well as the 2016 Wale Shoinka Center for Investigative Journalism, Nigerian Investigative Journalism of, Journalist of the Year. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for Olufi Sayo Shoyombo. Congratulations. This is the online category. I would like to call on Shun Onigbinde of the Budget Office to do the presentation of this award. You're welcome. He's also dressed like a winner. <laughs> Congratulations. Yeah. All right. Fisayo is my very good friend, yeah. Congratulations. Yeah, this is, uh, all right. Okay. <laughs> Thank you very much. Uh, since you entered Jerusalem, I'll let you say something briefly. Thank you. I reject every plan of the enemy to make me reject this award. <laughs> um, if there's something I've learned in 2017, it is that victory belongs to God, success belongs to God. We humans just try. But in many ways, this year, I found out uh, that only God rewards a uh, man with success. So I'm grateful to God. I want to dedicate this award to Mr. Simon Kolaoli, my former boss, to say thank you to him for everything I learned under him. Thank you. Thank you very much. Congratulations. Congratulations.